Good morning. This is day three of using the GoPro 9. Um, sometimes I'm like, yo, this is actually a pretty dope camera. And then other times I'm like, wow, this is really an annoying and dumb camera. So we'll see which one of that wins out. But I have a hunch considering I think it's more novelty that's winning right now than anything else. And as you can see, the low light is like pretty bad. I'm late for work and um, my car needs to be scraped. It's also locked. I had, I had somebody go through my car the other day. They didn't take anything. They just went through the, the center console, which is just full of empty gum containers. Today is a fairly busy day. A few shoots in the morning, a meeting in the afternoon, a bunch of editing in between. You know that like Monday vibe where you come in and you sort of have to get back in touch with reality of like, okay, where did I leave off on what? What needs to get done? So that's why I feel a little bit rushed because I have like this nagging feeling where there's something that I need to do this morning that's much more pertinent. And I'm completely blacked out right now. Nice. Nice. Day three of testing out this go. Did I already say this earlier? I'm headed uh, to get laundry. I, eh, I'm not gonna talk to you here. Just dropped a little man off at the grandparents, so you know where I'm going. <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding. But uh, I'm actually instead going to do something way more fun, which is laundry, baby. You already know what it is. You already know how much we all love laundry. Such a fun, such a fun activity that it's the best. Oh, hey there. Uh, so I did do laundry and I actually got Chinese food, sushi to be exact, over at Saki House while I waited for my laundry. Um, I'm not gonna lie to you and tell you that uh, there was great stuff that I could have filmed, but I could have filmed something and I didn't film anything. What I can tell you that is the truth is uh, I don't find the GoPro very inspiring uh, to film with because it's hard to prop up on stuff. Unless you have like one of the cool gadgets attached to it, uh, you kind of just have to set it on a flat surface. And while the world is full of flat surfaces, you'd be surprised how none of the world is full of flat surfaces that are at the proper height. So now you're pretty much stuck at like the same kind of square that you always are, except now you uh, have bad lighting and a weird wide angle for everything. And don't even get me started on the linear stuff because that's just a digital push in. Don't let anyone fool you with that linear GoPro angle nonsense. So yeah, while this, you know, type of video is not unique to the GoPro and not the GoPro's fault, it's just, it doesn't help it any. So I guess what I'm trying to say is, unless you are mountain biking in Moab, GoPro is not worth $500, despite the commercials. 
And while I can promise you that this is the last time I will speak on this topic for quite a while, um, I can't promise you that I won't use this GoPro because uh, I'm probably not going to return it till Thursday because I have the day off for Veterans Day. Um, yeah, did you have fun? Did you have fun at Grammy Grammys? <laughs> did you have fun? Is it so fun? Ah. Ah.